My name is Sergeant Brandon Chu. I'm the primary marksmanship instructor at Scott Sniper Instructor School. My job encompasses training entry-level lieutenants to become Scout Sniper Platoon Commanders. I train Scout Sniper Advanced Corps, I train team leaders and chief scouts on advanced marksmanship techniques as well as instructing entry-level students on becoming a Scout Sniper. You can get rid of that. You can go up here and saw that The hardest now. thing for the students, I think, in this training is the uh, continued demand for excellence at all times. Throughout the period of instruction, there's multiple evaluations that consist of 10 graded events. An average score is taken out of those graded events, so if you early on don't do very well, by the time you get to the very end, uh, your score won't be able to pick up enough. So we're constantly demanding excellence out of these Marines, and that's something that's essential to becoming a scout sniper. Right now what they're doing is trying to hone their skills on being able to look at a certain area, find a baseline of that area, and find the anomalies within that area. So currently they're doing an observation exercise where they're uh, looking for certain military items within a designated area. Reset to where you were at. Marine Scout snipers are the eyes, ears, and trigger figure of the battalion commander. So it's going to be our job, it's our duty to conduct ground reconnaissance. Uh, in a way, we differ from other reconnaissance elements. We conduct what's considered short range reconnaissance. So that means that we have to move within the enemy's threat ring. So every time I go out on patrol, I might be asked to go where the enemy can effectively engage me with his weapon systems. And because of the nature of that type of mission, I have to be able to move covertly and clandestine into his area of operations so I can report on his activities, his composition, his disposition to my commander. And my commander can then take that and he can uh, bring it forth from the battlefield. Still aiming for top left safety and top left edge. Yeah. These Marines are going to go off and, and be the guardian angels for uh, incoming units. They're going to paint a picture for that unit prior to going into a specific uh, battle zone, um, kind of giving them an advantage, taking away that, that uh, fog of war uh, to some extent because they're not going to go in blindly. I think the most re rewarding moment as an instructor is uh, when a student tells me that I've taught him something. It doesn't matter what it is, like how big or small, I know that I'm doing my job if, if he's learning, if he grasps a new concept, if he takes it back to the fleet, even if he's not successful at Scout Sniper School, he still can take that skill set back to his unit and he can pass that skill set on. And for me, I just want to help increase the lethality across the force. So anytime that a student learns something that helps him kill the enemy or uh, maintain his survivability on the battlefield, um, that's, that's what's rewarding to me. And it, it feels good when a student tells me, hey, hey, thank you, Sergeant, for teaching me that. It really helped me out.